Recovery Ohio focuses every single day on helping Ohioans who struggle with substance use disorder and helping their families. And that means we must continue to break the stigma while we aggressively support law enforcement's efforts to go after drug dealers. When I became governor, we created the Ohio Narcotics Intelligence Center, ONIC. Our goal? To help law enforcement with intelligence-based policing efforts and to accelerate their investigations. All of this is an ongoing effort to help one person, one family, and one community at a time. I'm Cindy Peterman, Director of the Ohio Narcotics Intelligence Center. We have operations in Cleveland and Columbus and are in 2022 are expanding to Toledo and Cincinnati. The ONIC brings cutting edge technology that some departments wouldn't otherwise be able to afford. We, we bring that technology into their cases. We get access to their information in those digital devices and we run them through the intelligence process and we create intelligence products that allow them to get to that valuable information faster. So ONIC is able to take the data that we're recovering from our investigations and they're able to link that data uh, and link suspects together that help us in those localized investigations. But more importantly, that data is also looked at uh, at a state and national level, so ONIC has the uh, analytical capabilities and the tools to be able to put that data together and aid our investigations in a way that we never were able to do before. Here in Hamilton County, the uh, community that we serve is mainly the African American. Uh, we do that through community outreach or proactive outreach, uh, making contact with people who have recently overdosed. So I am a social worker, so my portion is to get them connected to the treatment. So I do the phone calls and, you know, talk to them and just let them know that we're here to support them. They start trusting you and they start seeing your faces. They're like, hey, there's Scott from the QRT team. Uh, maybe he can help my brother, maybe he can help this person. Because of the governor and Recovery Ohio, we are able to make the different connections and use the different tools and resources to connect with the people and get them into treatment. One individual really sticks out to me, and that's a young man who, uh, from being 15 years old to 27 years old, spent that part of his life addicted to heroin and methamphetamine. And to be able, through our program, to connect him to treatment and recovery services and see that young man succeed and then go on to become a firefighter and go on to become a paramedic and he's now out there saving other people's lives. Um, that would not have happened without the support of Governor DeWine and Recovery Ohio and the work that we're doing at Ohio's Drug Task Forces with our QRTs and our outreach programs.